My soap is absolutely right. I will make today ridiculously amazing. Hey guys, I'm gonna slow a couple of clips down here for you so you can see everything happening uh, a little bit more clear. Uh, you can see that in my first few attempts here, I've still got that early extension in the middle of my swing that's been plaguing me for, heck, I guess my entire golfing life. Uh, but I also hope that you can see here that the middle of the swing, that early extension I've got, the hips going forward and the shoulders shrugging, it's a little bit less pronounced than it was before I started trying this new technique, this new swing thought. But what I'm hoping is that when I get to the top and I try and just bring my arm straight down and bring that down to hit the ball, you can see what's happening is that my arms are getting in here in front of me. I can't early extend here, even though that's what I've been doing in my swing. But when I practice and I, I've, I'm trying to make impact with the ball with bringing this club back to the ball, if my hips come forward, it's going to throw the club out and I'll never be able to make contact. So essentially, I'm trying to force my, my hips and my body to stay in this position, or even squat a little bit more and then turn to get out of the way and maintain that so that I'm clearing more properly instead of like this. I'll be more like this. I'm trying to force that to happen. And in order to, to break, 20 plus years of ingrain. I've been doing this for 20 plus years. I've, I've, I've never watched myself on video. I've never analyzed my swing or tried to make swing changes like that. You're trying to break 20 years worth of a habit. It's just, it's just damn near impossible. So it's going to take a long time. And here's, here's how I look at it. Don't make any swing changes and then immediately take them to the course. This is something I'm going to do on the driving range when I've got a couple of days in between range and play so that I'm not going to the range and out there playing with my swing because when you get on the course, it's time to play golf. It's not time to play mechanic. So I'm going to be the mechanic on the driving range for a while and I'm going to give us an honest try and I'm going to try and get up to the top, like I said, with this triangle and then just feel like I'm bringing it right down, right in front of me. That way my body has to stay back out of the way. I'll keep working on that at the range and then over time that will start to ingrain and take over and then it will come into my course play. But on course, I'm not trying to make any swing changes. I'm not trying to think mechanics. I'm just out there trying to focus on the shot, the strategy and all of that. So I don't want to bring all that stuff to the course with me. It has to stay at the driving range. But I'm going to try it. I can't get better until I fix this issue. It's not an issue that, that, that I feel like I can get to the apex of my abilities with. So I'm gonna try it. It's gonna be a hard road. It's gonna take a long time to change all of these things, but I'll keep working on it and I'll update you and I'll start showing you progress videos. And as you can see in the video earlier, there's not a lot of difference between what I was doing before and what happened today. This is just my first session, so I don't expect to see a lot of change. But one thing I did notice, I noticed I was hammering the golf ball. 
this movement here of getting to the top and then bringing it down like that, just your arms in front of you, I was hammering it. I bet you I was getting at least into the 10, 12 yards with every iron on average. Uh, just a longer, more pure ball flight, and it was a little bit more effortless. So I think this is going to work out. It's going to get me what I need, but it's going to take a lot of time. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Be sure to share this on social media. I'd appreciate it. I'm on Instagram a lot. I post a lot of photos and videos, but you can't put you know, links directly in Instagram. So my link's in my bio. Also, my webpage is on there. You can check out my blog. I try to do weekly blog posts. Um, and I've got some more videos coming. I've got some really cool stuff. I've got two new ideas for on the course sort of mind games, different ways to keep score. Uh, you'll have to check those out. They're coming. I'm not going to give you anything away, but they're coming up soon. Thanks. Appreciate it. Don't forget to click thumbs up. See you next time.